watched seeing RuPaul's Drag Race. <laughs> this land ain't your land, you pretty much stole it. Right out of our hands, you made our people sign a tree that we didn't fully understand. So give us back our fucking land. <laughs> I was trying to come up with my drag persona, and the best name for First Nations drag queen has already been taken, <laughs> Manifest Destiny. No. No. But it's okay because I have a backup, and I want to pay homage to my somewhat forced Mennonite upbringing with Beth Lehem. <laughs> Cause she's not just here to crash the party, she's here to evangelize it. <laughs> Another one that I had um, is a little bit more basic, but still fun, Pow Wow Princess. <laughs> Only because I would be allowed to say that, and like some of you would not. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage. Can someone read this please? <laughs> and it's great, with Pow Wow Princess, it's a perfect time because I can buy all my costumes at Spirit Halloween. Oh. Let's talk about that. Still they call me savage. Still they call me Indian. The history of birds that I feel is worth taking in. Cartier and Columbus were just a couple idiots. Trying to take our culture, what it means to be indigenous. All I want to know is who I am. On a diary, I do it, you know, my phone, whatever. I can write it down. But then you have a choice. You can either do something with it, or you can let it go, burn it, and it's gone forever. You know, I chose to do something with it. Somebody might choose differently, you know. And in doing so, you know, I, I speak about my journey, you know, as an individual, and uh, I want to share this next song with you that's really, really special. They design it in the bed to take away the children, the foundation of community. Break away those buildings, now today we stand in unity. Now, will I live? Will I make it out of this? If I try to run from it, will I stay feeling helpless? There was extreme gang violence happening here, and uh, we wanted to put a stop to it. So we did a gig that was called Unity in the Community, you know. So I just want to say miigwech, thank you for having me here. I know you don't know me. I know I don't know you. But I want you to know me. And I want me to know you. Wish the world would see. You just want to be loved. Not surrounded by booze. Or inflicted by drugs. I see the abuse. No one's harder to trust. Those marks in your skin make it harder to love. No, you want to escape, but there's nowhere to run. So I encourage you, if you're not indigenous, listen. You know these stories that are being shown, everything you know, that's happening right now. It's such a pivotal time. You know, and it's such a pivotal time. Are you gonna be on the side that's oppressing us day in and day out? That's killing us day in and day out? that's disregarding our voices day in and day out? Or are you going to be on the side of change? You know? Checking the people within your own circle who are dishing out the ignorance. Don't give 